When I was 13, I felt the Lord ask me to give my life in missions. We wanted to go to where the most need was. God opened the door to Montenegro. It's the most unreached country in all of Europe with just a handful of churches. That sense of feeling completely alone as a follower of Jesus here is, I think, the reality that most believers face. Because the churches have 15 or 20 people, or max, like 30 people, you feel like you're the only one who's really trying to follow Jesus. Montenegrins are some of the nicest people, and they're genuinely nice. It's not like a facade that they put on. We know the task that God has before us cannot be accomplished with just us two. We need more workers. I believe that none of us have tomorrow guaranteed. I believe we need to take advantage of every moment when they can, you know, through Jesus, experience that reconciliation with God and that forgiveness in their hearts. Then what, as a culture, has always defined them won't be what defines them anymore. Being a missionary has challenged me and stretched me in more ways than I ever thought the human mind, the human heart could be stretched and could be pulled in so many ways for Jesus and for the Montenegrins. Each step is worth it.